Kamika Forbes, goalkeeper from Trinidad and Tobago. Sensational effort from you and the team tonight. Yeah, um, everyone came out with a positive mindset and we said we're going all or nothing. We're gonna, everyone's going to give until they can't go anymore. And that's what we came out here to do. And I was one of the leaders there on the team and they needed me very badly. So I kept positive, uh, positive energy and the team feed off of my positive energy. Is this the biggest game you've played? Yes, I must admit this is one of the biggest games I have played and first time playing against the US national team. I played against the U20 before I played against Sydney Roo back in 2010. Despite the one nothing loss, it seems like the team's pretty positive about the result. Yeah, this comes as a win for us. Um, one little US, the mighty giants of CONCACAF. This is very positive for us going into the next two games. Like we said before, we, um, we respect USA, but we're not, we're, not, we're not fearing them. Okay, we come out, we have a job to do as well as the US had a job to do. And I think we have a positive result out of this game. Obviously, your goalkeeping a highlight. What are some of the other positives you take away from this match? I just <laughs> um, positive taking out of this match, um, getting the momentum and staying confident. Um, I had a great game tonight. I hope I hope we continue on to the next two games. How do you approach those next two games in terms of trying to qualify? Uh, the next game, go, uh, next game um, we have a different approach, a different game plan. So each game we take one at a time, and the next game we have a different game plan. We're not going to go in the same game plan as we have for the U.S. Thank you, Camille. All right, thank you. Christy Rampone, captain for the United States. Uh, you got the result tonight. Got the result. Wasn't our best match. Um, I think Trinidad and Pedro did an awesome job. Keeper did an excellent job. They disrupted us. We didn't really get into the flow, the tempo, but we have a couple more games to go. Were you guys surprised at all by the performance for Trinidad? No. Uh, you know, we had scouted them. We knew they were athletic and quick, and they got a lot of numbers behind the ball, which makes it difficult. They played a five back, so it was hard to break through them. But, you know, we have to go back, watch film, and, and get better for the next game. Obviously, the U.S. always a world-class side. Are you surprised by the development uh, in CONCACAF of some of the other teams? No, not surprised. It's actually encouraging and it's exciting to see that CONCACAF is growing. And you know, they put on a good performance. You know, we only won one nothing, and you know, it's it's growing, and that's credit to soccer. What are the main positives you take away from tonight? Uh, three points. We got a win. Um, you know, I think we changed the point of. Uh, changed the point a little bit better um, in the second half. I think our transition was a little bit better in the second half, but we still got to pick up the pace, one and two touch, you know, find a better rhythm in the next game. Finally, what's the mentality going into the next group game? Um, try to get better. You know, that's the mentality of, you know, go back to the drawing board, get better so that we can get on to, um, you know, into that semifinal game. Thanks, Christy. Okay, thank you.